Hello everyone, my name is Rainy. Welcome back. Episode 5, Lightning Round, Phantom Menace, Attack of the Clones, Episode 1 of this guide, 2, 3, 4, now we're back to 5, Season 5, let's get it. Y'all should already know what time it is, so as I said, these are gonna get shorter and shorter, and I'm gonna leave the guide as usual right here so that you guys can refer back to it the entire video and off rip you can already see that over half of this is <laughs> I, I over half of this i have deemed filler off the bat we are skipping one episode so we're going to episode two and then going in order all the way down to episode 13 before we revisit episode one so keep that in mind season five is more excellent storytelling more quality direction more great dialogue more character development it's fantastic there are no standalone episodes this entire season everything is part of an arc which is why i deem a lot of it very unnecessary but let's get into it. Episodes 2 through 5. So 2, 3, 4, and 5 is the intro to Saw Gerrera. Saw Gerrera is a cool character because he dives into the question, what if not everyone in service of the Republic was wholly altruistic and a little bit unhinged? That's Saw Gerrera. And you can see the seeds planted in this particular arc. Now, the reason I crossed these off is because he leaves the show just as quickly as he comes into it. Looking back now, it seems like they were just shoehorned in there for the sake of having them, as opposed to them actually playing a bigger role in the Clone Wars. So, if and when I do my Rebels Guide, if you guys want me to do a Rebels Guide, then I suggest you watch that first, and then double back to this if you really, really, really like Saw Gerrera. But otherwise, you don't need to watch it. Next is the Younglings arc. Again, a four episode arc that you totally do not need to watch. Ahsoka's in it for a little bit. Yoda's in it for a little bit. But we already know what happens when Yoda takes charge of people younger than him and how well Ahsoka performs under pressure when she has the lives of Younglings in her hands. This arc in particular is more about Younglings finding themselves and finding the Kyber Crystals for their lightsabers and building their lightsabers and then being taken hostage by Hondo and a bunch of his pirates. If that sounds cool to you, you can totally watch it if you got the time like that you can totally watch it but if you're here for the guide and you've been following the guide and you've liked it thus far up until this point then you could totally skip this next up is the droid boys arc throughout all of star wars you'll notice that nobody really cares about droids nobody really notices them and a lot of people are super mean to them this arc in particular shows you just how important droids are to the war effort and what a pivotal role they play in the success of a lot of missions now if you're gonna watch any episode in this arc watch episode 12 missing in action or just skip the arc entirely the only reason i suggest episode 12 is you can see right here uh clone trooper gregor is in it but if you don't care about the clones that much then you could skip the arc entirely now these last two arcs are the only arcs that i suggest you actually watch in this entire season because i feel like all the before stuff is kind of just a distraction which is why i suggest you mosey on down to the maul versus death watch arc and that is where you revisit episode one and then skip all the way to episode 14, 15, and then 16. This arc is incredible. It shows Maul at his peak. He is merciless. He is ruthless. He is truly the epitome of a Sith Lord. He's one of my favorite characters, and I love anything with him in it. It's also the last you see of Maul in the entire series. There's some really emotional scenes in this, and it's a really fantastic bunch of episodes, so I really suggest y'all watch this one. Now, we're moving on to the last arc. The official last arc in the official last season of this show because we still got one more video to put out next week because after the release of this season there actually was a sixth technical season known as the lost missions that was put out later but as far as the show and one character in particular this is the end of the actual series so this last four episode arc is what i call the betrayal a very heavy focus on anakin and ahsoka the last two feature ventress as well and if you remember in i think either the first or second guide a character that i told you would be incredibly important later on that character comes back for this also i may just be bugging but i feel like this particular arc is incredibly cinematic like way more cinematic than any of the episodes that preceded it i don't know if they wanted to go for that look because it was the presumed end of the series or if they got a different director to do this arc or something this arc looks fantastic and it is fun to watch and it is a really good time so that brings us to the end congratulations you made it but next week we still got one episode left where i break down the lost missions and it's probably going to be the shortest video 
But for the sake of continuity and for the sake of keeping content rolling up until the release of season seven, we're just going to do that one in a whole separate video. So once again, be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. If you got any friends that aren't into Star Wars or if you got any friends that are into Star Wars but haven't seen Clone Wars and you suggest that they watch it, share this guide and bring them to this video because that's the best way to help. It really helps the channel when you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe and stuff, which is why I say it at the end of every video. And if you hit the bell icon, you'll get notified whenever we upload. So it's a win-win. Anyway, that's it for me, and that is it for the watch guide officially, but we still got one more episode to go, and I will see you guys next Sunday for the final installment in Rainio Valle's official Star Wars The Clone Wars chronological filler-free watch guide. I'll see you guys next time.